What up, people? We're back in Anime Last Stand, and in this video, we're gonna show you a uh, glitched Dio. We're gonna show you uh, his last Evo, basically. We're also gonna showcase Pucci. We're gonna showcase uh, Giorno Evo. He's basically a leaf dude that you could place uh, as a hill unit. Very good, very high damage. Probably the best leaf unit in the game right now. We're also going to showcase uh, Kira Evo. He has a new uh, bomb uh, element. Or, uh, yeah, damage. He has a new bomb damage. We're going to show you it anyways. Uh, we're also going to show you uh, how to just get the deal. Basically, uh, Evo. Right now we have him like this. And we're just doing, basically we have a first part of the video. If you want to follow all the steps, you could just click the link at the top. It'll bring you to that video. You could uh, yeah, watch that and see what's up. But this is just a continuation to that video. Uh, right now we already have all the items to Evo. We need two of Blessed Corpse. We need two Corpse uh, Ridge Cages. Two Vampire Bones. We need three Moon Fragments. These spawn every 24 hours. We're going to show you their spawns. Vampire Diary, uh, two legs, and I think that's about it. That's all you really need to Evo him. Let's go jump into the portal and let's spawn. Let's show you the spawn uh, places for uh, the moon fragment. So they changed the way it spawned the moon fragments. Uh, it only spawns between... Uh, zero zero and zero five. So there's a five minute window every hour for it to spawn. What's up? What's up? We're just doing a little vid. Okay. So it should spawn any minute now. The spawn locations are here, 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 here. Here and here. Those are the places where the moon fragment could spawn. Okay, let's just uh, get some money and chill. You're going to see green text at the bottom when it spawns. If you're going to do, basically to complete it, you have to have Pucci Evo. His second Evo to start picking up moon fragments or else you can't pick it up to do that you have to get the diary diary drops from legend act one in this stage basically the one i'm in right now that's where the diary drop uh drops and uh yeah then you have to talk to uh sukuna and then you talk to speed car uh speed wagon and yeah that's how you get that stuff. That's how you get all the three pages. You have to complete all the pages before going on to the next one. It's really simple. Let's just uh, do this. Why is there a lag? It's not good. You shouldn't worry too much, though. You should be good. So just be patient, even though you don't see the moon uh, fragment spawn. There is a window. For it to spawn, we just gotta wait and be patient. Okay. Yeah, it used to be a 10 minute window, but then they decided that uh, they don't like you guys to get it. So, kind of based. Okay, this is actually making me a little worried that we don't see it. Because we only have a little bit left to go. There's, there's the minute window right here. One minute for it to spawn.
That's a literal poopy if it doesn't spawn. Oh, it spawned. Nice. So, turn off the 3x speed. Okay, which area did it spawn in? Right here, huh? Yeah, so right here. I already picked it up today, so it's not going to let me pick it up again. Only once per day. And it's from whenever you picked it up first. So that's about it. Now we're going to Evo uh, Poochie. Most of All right, so we have the stuff. Now let's... Uh, talk to Pucci. We got the recipe after getting the 75 uh, things. So first thing you got to do is Evo Pucci. So search Pucci. Evo. Yeah. Got everything there. There we go. And then you just accept the quests. Here we go. And now we got the thing. So, uh, we got to make sure we have 50 of the cursed essence, cosmic essence. Uh, I think we could craft it. Yeah, it looks like we have a lot of stuff. So, cosmic, we do 50. 50 cosmic essence, craft. Then we go here. And we craft uh, this craft i need 25 mythic shards i believe uh items how much would 25 be how much do i have items we need to have seven there we go all right, let's craft. Then we craft this. I don't have everything. Oh. No? One of those? Did I not claim it? Oh, makes sense. Okay, there. I was like, what? We got scammed? All right, there we go. So now when you Evo Dio, his stats are good. Yep. So now when you Evo him, you have to unlock him. This is all the stuff you need to Evo. It's not too crazy. And boom. There we go. He's evo And now we're going to do a showcase with uh, the new units I was talking about. Oh my gosh, the diary actually still spawned. That's hilarious. Let's see where it spawns. This is just a random uh, part of the video, but we're basically about to start uh, the thing. We got our other account. I heard there was a spawn here as well and the summon spawn mysterious item spawned wow i waited for like 10 years for this item now it's easy to get what a lame ass thing it's just teasing me at that point either way let's uh start by uh equipping the characters we need so we have we use the damage tree for deal basically on this one so skill tree we use damage tree and this one we're going to be using uh every one that we're going to equip is basically going to be crit tree And this is the skill tree. You could put this here if you want range, but we just went for faster attacks. I think that's better. It is what it is, though. You know what you could also do? If you're doing, wait, if I do a skill tree again, 
Maybe instead of doing this, the range, you do this instead. Yeah, I think this might be better. You go like this. But we'll do that. It doesn't really matter, really. Strong is strong. It's not going to save your life. Okay, let's just jump into it. We're going to do infinite. Uh, On the new map, might as well. Infinite normal, select. Teleport, uh, story, boom. Let's go. Yo, you still had time. Ah, oh, maybe you still have time. That's tough. Well, Oshi's actually really good still. Get her. Get the celestial Oshi. So, yeah. We're evoing, uh, we evo Giorno, max skill tree, crit. We have Kira, max skill tree, crit. He has a new bomb damage thing. We have, uh, max skill tree deal, max level. They're all max levels. We have Pucci, not max skill tree though. He's just max level. He's kind of mid. There was a bug with Pucci that made him really broken. But, uh, yeah, we're not here to find bugs and stuff. We're just here to kind of chill. All right, I'll spawn these dudes there. And let's farm it up. So we'll be back when we have two bajillion dollars. All right, people, we have ten bajillion dollars. And uh, let's first do Poochie Evo. Let's... Check them out. All right. So, as you can see, he does fully we on placement, not hybrid. Kind of mid. If he was hybrid, I would say he's a pretty decent unit. Uh, he takes four upgrades to get the hybrid. Kind of expensive because you can see it's like eight grand the last one. It's almost ten grand. Not a starter. So, you really have to have farms going before you could start using them. Some people argue that he's good, but I think he's kind of bad. He's not on my team, that's for sure. There was a bug with him that was used to exploit infinites. That's how people got leaderboards and stuff. He has reset the universe. If I use that thing, someone said that it resets your passives. Let's see if that's actually true. So if I use room and I use reset the universe, no, it doesn't reset the... That's so cool. But it, it literally, it's just like Law's ability. Yeah, what's up, Goat? So that's all right, but it doesn't reset his ability. Unless I have to click on him again. It did reset his ability. Now the question is, does it reset his ability when you already used it three times on one unit? You know? If you use your law ability three times on one unit, if you press reset the universe, will it reset the stuff as well? That's a lot. Long time to wait. Maybe the Poochie glitch would be like if you could just keep using it. That makes sense. That would be a Poochie glitch. Either way, we're done with him. He's done. We're not, we don't really care about VFX here. We care about units that are good. Let's use the meta uh, leaf unit right now. This dude's meta leaf. Uh, he's hybrid right away. Circle. I think he's always circle, yeah. He just gets bigger circle. We replaced the... Uh, Sukuna with him, so you could see stats. They have no objects on them to enhance their stats. Except for Dio, for some reason. But that's okay. It's just crit and range. It doesn't really matter. You will you forgive me. Alright, but 31 damage is good. And he does the crit. He does good range. Obviously, we could boost it up with... That's like... That's crazy range, still. You know? That's insane range. He's covering the whole map. If I'm using Sukuna, if I'm doing Oshi too. He's just destroying it. Okay.
When COD 6 streams? BO6? Soon, yo. Soon. Trust. Zombies, yo. Zombies. All right. Now, let's uh, look at one of the meta fire units right now. So this dude has bomb damage. This is what I'm talking about. He has bomb damage and uh, let's just do that. You didn't see nothing. All right. Explosive line AOE. And he goes to hybrid in four. He's not too bad. Not too expensive to make the four. His last upgrade to four was like 4K. Which is just normal. I think it was 1k. Let's sell him again. Let's actually see. Let's actually study this. So 1.3, 1.9. Let's just say 2k, 2k, 2k. And then 4k. 2k, 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 4k. So it's not too bad. Not too expensive. Easy to farm that. Um, yeah. So basically he does line. But then he goes back to Circle AoE eventually. Circle AoE, but his attack speed does decrease. But that's not bad. That's not bad still. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's how much he's doing. He's doing 34 and 60 million. So he's doing almost like a hundred million damage, yeah. The bomb damage I heard is crazy. It's not bad though. He doesn't have good range, so range is needed. If you have Dio and you have uh, no, sorry, if you have um, Sukuna and you have Oshi, use that for him. It's gonna help him be a lot stronger. All right. Now, let's look at the the godly unit. So, this is Max Skill Tree. He attacks fast, even though we didn't go crazy. Hybrid on placement. Then he switches to this. This is pretty garbage, but I mean, it's all right. It's not that good, though. It's kind of mid. He's mid. Only the last upgrade is good. That's mid, mid, mid. If you're looking at this upgrade by 10 and you spend all that money, this dude doesn't even cost that much and he's already beating him in his avatar. Look. Like, yeah. There's something wrong. He needs to be buffed because he's kind of doo doo flake. Now he's starting to do more damage. But, like, it took all the way to upgrade 11 for him to actually be all right. And even this is not even all right. This is just okay. He's doing like 60 million or 55 million, you know? Now, when you click this, though, that's when he actually does some good uh, damage. He also has his ability that freezes. It says for like 60 seconds or something. Why is this locked? Can someone explain why his stun effect is locked? Or is it just a bug? Because I have maxed out everything. But he's still locked. Weird. Maybe it's just not cool enough. But yeah. Over heaven. There's the wardle. And it freezes for quite a bit of time. They're getting killed right away so you can't really see. But it freezes them for a long time. I saw them rock through that thing though eventually. Like let's just uh, delete this. See, uh, Law's still killing him. Let's see if they still... Yeah, they're walking through now. So they stop getting frozen at a certain point, even though it's still, like, weird colors. I think it's just bugged, I would assume. Or maybe the stun is not as long as they think it is. Well, that's cool. Let's see his stats right here. Even though it's not the same. Even though it's a different skill tree. Let's see how it compares. People are saying he does over 100 mil. But you're literally using all the resources. That's not actually true stats. That's inflated. Because. 
you're basically this is actually his raw stats it's doing 75 he doesn't do 100 million that's Escanor that's giving more damage and that's uh yeah but it, it's still good you know it's still it's still good he's just not overwhelmingly good I think that he could be a lot better Schmitty Schmurphy he also summons dudes I forgot about that yeah people spawn People say he is the best unit, though, in the game right now. Not bad, not bad. But for a godly, you think he'd be, like, broken. Yeah. We don't use damage skill tree because crit does a lot more damage. He's doing 55% crit because we have the Garu thing. So 55% crit, that's a plus 25% crit, yeah. I think we take that over whatever. Crit does two times damage when it... Right? Does crit do two times damage? I don't know, because the numbers don't really pop up when he crits, right? Let's see, damage numbers. We have to delete this one. Is he just always critting? He's the let's destroy bomb man. He's the only one that's attacking, so we should see some uh, some variation, right? Three hundred, or that's just max health of the dudes. Uh we won't be able to see what the different numbers are. There's no overkill thing, but I would like to see at least like maybe a change in the color of the numbers, you know, so we could actually know when it crits. But that's about it. That's the video. Uh, let me know if you got any questions. And I think that's about it. Yeah. These are the only units you need to care about. Everyone else is pretty much trash. That's why I didn't review them. Let me know if I'm wrong about that, though. Because I could be wrong about some things. But uh, everyone's saying that everything is uh, trash. Crits have exclamation points. Okay, they do have exclamation points. Okay, I see. They have exclamation points. That's subtle, yo. You can hardly see it. Damn. Yeah, they should change the color of it so we could actually understand it better. You have a question? What's the question, Cope? No. How about that? Carrying you in World 1 story? You're in World 2. You did World 2 with me. Were you trying to make me look evil? Trying to make me look bad, huh? How dare you. Alright guys, that's about it. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. Peace.